this thing on. There we go. Okay, that's better. Hey guys, today we're going to be reviewing um, a movie. Um, a movie review. Welcome back to... Uh, Jurassic World is the worst thing in the history of anything ever. I did that wrong. Jurassic World is the worst thing in the history of everything. In the history of it. Is the worst thing in the... Is the worst everything in the history of anything ever. Jurassic World is that. That is what Jurassic World is. So I, I got Jurassic World from Netflix. Uh, but I canceled my subscription and I've had it for eight years. And uh, I was like, hey, I should probably do a review on this. Look at how minimalistic this cover is. I actually kind of dig that. The cover. I mean, like, usually there's, like, shit at the top. If it tells you it's DVD only. Maybe it tells you Steven Spielberg production starring fucking Epic Faglord. Like, here, look at this. Widescreen collection. Special collector's edition. And then there's a quote, Angel Delina Jolie delivers, she's the ultimate super superhero. That's a fucking that's that's bullshit. This is this is Tomb Raider, not fucking Spider-Man. Looper, look at all of this. You got uh the the guy pointing this way, and then himself, I think, also pointing that way. You got a quote there, you got a tagline there. You got the name there, you got who it's by, and you got the actors. That's, I think this cover needs to be redesigned. Uh, put them together, have them back to back, uh, uh, and then just loop her, okay? Number two. Ah, shit, I didn't say number one in the first one, but don't worry about it. Number two, the movie. Step Brothers is the worst anything in the history of everything ever. If you like dumbfounded comedies with this retard who stars in almost every comedy ever, what is that? What is that? Adam Sandler? What's so funny about Will fucking Farrell? He can he can grow he can he can wear a full size elf costume and scream about Santa for an hour and a half and people will buy that shit. And there's not that there's nothing funny about this guy either. Have you seen the reviews for that new Sherlock Holmes movie that just came out with these two retards? Who thought that was going to be a good idea? Ah, fuck a label in this one. You're just going to hear my goddamn voice anyway. Number three, the plot. Some mentally retarded 18-year-olds, but they're actually played by people that are 40. Some mentally retarded 40-year-olds that act as 40-year-olds that are 40-year-olds, but they act as if they're 18-year-olds. Why did I buy this? It's not even good. Number four, uh, details, I guess. That sounds pretty good. Wait, where the fuck did the accent go? Oh, the, 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 the details. I mean, look at this. Look at this shit right here, dude. This isn't even a movie. I, I bought this at Goodwill, okay? I just like robots. This thing's four by three, and it came out in like two thousand and fucking nine. It's three. It's three hours and forty six minutes. It's three hours and forty six minutes, and it's got more than. Where the fuck did I put the fucking Jurassic? It's got more than Jurassic World does on the front. Number number nine, the presentation. It's the same thing on the actual DVD itself. Also, slip covers, you know, those things. Little piece of cardboard. What is this, a fucking Pokemon card? Where we guys check out. Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Maximum Mo fucking Pokemon. Today, I'm going to be opening a Pokemon booster pack. Here, let me get my camera in place. Give me some fucking gems! Garbage! Trash! Shit! Oh, what is this? What is this shite? Oh my god, we got a fucking legendary!
Actually, one of these came with like some trading cards in them. It's number six, isn't it? Number six. Oh shit! Oh shit! Which one's this? Number six, like I thought. Oh my god, guys, check it out! I got a fucking legendary card! I got a fucking legendary card! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Number 10! Number 10, that's all I got. What movie was. Ah, yes, Jurassic World. Jurassic World. Oh, you like Dutch angles? You know, one of these kind of things going on? I, I was watching some greedy cunt. I'm just kidding, he's one of my favorite YouTubers. Talk about how he doesn't like Dutch angles, so I made this just for him, but he's never gonna fucking watch this. Uh, Jurassic War. Here, I'll just. Is it so hard to do that? No, because directors do that. You know what you can do? See, the issue is I got a little tripod mount on my fucking camera bottom, so it tilts it sideways. But considering that I own Godzilla 2014, the worst movie of all fucking time, you wonder what can you do with this piece of shit? I'll show you what you can do with it. You can, you can put it underneath your camera and hold it up. And now the Dutch angle is fucking gone, and everything's better. Man, film directors should really take on from this. What is the worst film you've ever seen? No, I'm not talking about Grown Ups 2 or Transformers 2. I like Transformers 2, by the way. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Everybody's entitled to their own fucking opinion. You like this? You like this? That's what you get when you do too much meth. This is why you don't do meth, kids. This is crack. Crystal rock cocaine. I'm the Wee Army. Number 11, Morgan Freeman. I want to watch this movie. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. I'll review Lucy sometime. It's got Scarlett Johansson and... I'm Morgan Freeman. I star in like every movie. What movie has Morgan Freeman not been in? Hasn't been in Godzilla. Hasn't been in Gravity. Hasn't been in Hellboy 2. Hasn't been in Deadpool. Hasn't been in, in, in Initial D. Hasn't been in Chronicles Clash of Titans. Clue the movie. Number 12, free, free right, free video movie, free video right move, free license, freedom of speech, amendment one, I think. Back to the topic at hand, since creative rights are no issue, but people like to create issues of it, I.H.G. you're off the movie maker, your movie sucks, don't work, and they like to put intros at every single intro of their intro claiming about that one law that prohibits you using free use or whatever, which I think uh, movie producers are shit or whatever. I won't even want to show you a clip from this movie because that's how bad it is. Jurassic World, I, let me tell you, I love Chris Pratt. I've only seen him in one movie. And that happens to be the Lego Movie 3D. And I bought that shit, I bought the Everything's Awesome Edition for 60 bucks when it came out. Blu-ray 3D, Blu-ray, and DVD, and digital code. I fucking love that movie, let me tell you. God damn, that's a great fucking movie. If you thought about staples of great movies over the fucking years, Lego Harry, I mean, Lego, St I, I, Lego the, mo the movie, the Lego movie, 3D. Oh man, that's a good one. Number 101, the, the, the end, or something like that. So, uh, that, I mean, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Uh, so, you know. But mine's obviously, you, you know. You know, mine's obviously the best opinion out of all those opinions. Because, you know, I'm a... Right here, David Spain and Joe Dirt. That's like... 9 out of 10 on IMDb, I think. How do they usually end off their videos? They get near the end of the fucking movie. They finish the movie. They, like, one last time mention how garbage it is. And then they, like... Uh... Throw, like, a little, uh... Like, a Twitter, like, a at Ralph... Peppy or whatever the fucking bullshit. 
little outro card. Uh, here I got it. Here we go. My razor. My Oh, by the way, this isn't hate on uh, Ralph the Movie Maker or your moviesuss.org. I hate everything. I think you guys are great. I'm just, uh, uh, I'm just, uh, I'm looking for attention. So if, if you guys want to, you guys want to partner me in a video, uh, hook me up. You know, I can do a pretty good movie review. I'm not that biased. I own a shitload of movies. Uh, you know, hit me up. You know, hit me in the DMs. Hit me in the DMs. Uh, Alright, cool, thanks guys, bye. No, but really though, hit me up. I mean, I'm looking for a good company, looking for some good brand association right now. Come on, Pe Pepsi. I love Pepsi. Pepsi, you know?